Name the vibes. Yeah, get one of these right, if you have a cast off. iron. What is a podcast? Get, I will clip your tongue. <laughs> Bro, I'm dead wolf like 700 <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Tears Over Beers. <laughs> That should be the real intro. The most important podcast on the internet. Ladies and gentlemen, DeNovo Realty Radio. <laughs> Welcome, Welcome to another episode, episode of Tears Over Beers. Beers. With Garrett and Ian. <laughs> with Garrett and Ian. Cheers, episode buddy. Number 13. Maybe. Lucky 13. Who knows? It could be Clearly 12. our best work yet. We've had a little mini break. It was a while since we did our last one, so <clears throat> glad to be back. It's been a busy in Q4. The studio with you in the studio today we are doing our favorite amazon purchases so i did last or week our top five our top five our top five <clears throat> yeah in no particular order are yours in order um no mine are not in order no, so not. we're gonna rally them off you want me to go first all right here You're it is itching to go. Let's do it. so i feel like this is a like it looks dumb okay. well it doesn't look dumb but it doesn't sound that cool but this is I honestly. Knew you were gonna have that thing. This, I thought about bringing that thing, and then I mine broke, or I gave it to somebody. This is one of my favorite. This is actually probably the. I bought one of these in 2012 on Amazon. It was one of my first Amazon purchases, so I mean, it's an important thing to me. It's it's in my heart. But that's not the one because somebody broke. Oh, I've own. owned probably 11 of these, uh -huh. and for a while back in the day, because I used to let brand. other people use it, they would dip it in the. So this is a drink stir, by the way, right? Stirs the drinks. It's a fantastic. It's, it's also got some. It's also got some power too. Yeah, it a ten horse or what? But <laughs> I let other people use it, and they would dip it in the drink up to Dude, here, yeah, yeah. and that would kill it every time. And I didn't figure <laughs> that out for a while. But you can't get you can't dip the drink all the way into this. But you this can't. is one of my favorite purchases. It's also disgusting because I don't clean it out. Yeah, much. it's really nasty. So, but protein <clears throat> drinks, uh, cocktails. Uh, protein drinks, of course, is the first one Garrett drinks. Off. I mean, that's just like the most common thing I use. I, I protein use, like, drinks, pre-workout drinks, post-workout drinks, chocolate milk. <laughs> Basically, anything related to lifting up weights. It's you a, can, it's a great you can tool. stir your weights with it. <laughs> what do you got? My first one, another kitchen item. <clears throat> this handy little number. What? Hold on. Is I don't have any idea what that is. If you want to take a guess, like uh, it's a sheet to protect you from your sh children. It's a kitchen item. I'm punching you. It's a you kitchen just item. Hold it up and they. Only in the kitchen. <laughs> I don't know what any, it is. Any? No. Shelby's got nothing. Do you know what it's, that is? It's for cleaning uh, cast iron pans because you don't use like what and stuff, right? So you just pop but the you link. Can, you can. I'll get you the link. So you can put it in anything that's hard to clean and like swish it around. With ah. some soap, but you like can scrub and scrape. The, I'm disappointed in myself. I've never stuff. seen one of those. Yeah. Do you have cast as iron in, stuff? You don't as, cook. Yeah. No, I, I do cast iron. Yeah. You cook protein. Primarily drink. protein. Protein <laughs> drinks. I put my protein drinks. Right in the kitchen. Yeah, it's good to fry no, I them do, up. I do steaks in the cast iron. Yeah. I did it on so Sunday. this is the only good way to clean it, really. Mm. It's like $8. The Sorry. last one, excuse me, the last one we had went in the garbage disposal and it's not go well for either yeah, that doesn't seem either like item that would take this well or the disposal. The disposal. Item Can't number see it. Two. got it. <laughs> item number two for me. Any guesses? Don't be another smoke machine. Any guesses? <laughs> this is No no don't don't Okay. Is it a noisemaker for me sleep? You, you read the top, didn't you? No, I didn't. Yes. Oh, it says it on there? It, yeah, it looks like something that just makes a bunch of so, noise. So this is, yes, this is a uh, noise maker for sleeping. And Is that know, like its primary function is making noise? Yes, white noise. <clears throat> the original white noise machine. Plug it in. Let's hear it. And yeah, let's do that real-time test here. Yeah. Oh, I'm interested. And I've had this for probably <clears throat> four or if five years. If you don't years, sleep so. with a white noise machine, you're and messing up. The thing about this Show one. Show me looking like you're dumb. Try it out. Well, sleep the thing about baby. this one. Oh, so what is this? So it's actually like real, it's like making real noise it's, yeah. versus like a speaker making noise. Uh -huh. And like, if you want like the legit white noise, this that's is That's not it. loud enough to this drown is... out my children. No? It's pretty loud. This is the low setting. Yeah, it's not. This is the loud. one we have is ocean sound it's, and it's real loud. Is it a speaker? Yeah. Yeah. See, I like this one because it's actual real noise. You ever like... Here's a funny thing that people... I also don't. sleep with earplugs in, so that's why this is funny. <laughs> <laughs> I 
but I can hear, hear it. I can hear it through the earplugs. Earplugs are not meant to block everything out. Yeah, out. yeah. The funny thing that I get like out of the white noise machine, there's two things. So as soon as you turn it on, I start yawning. I'm like, oh, man, it's time for bed. Don't fall asleep during this episode. <clears throat> but also, when you have been listening to it all night for like five, six hours, if you're like me, and then you turn it off, it's just like, oh, like what it's happened like, to all the sound? Yeah, it's eerie. Yeah. I can't do complete silence. Like, I get freaked out. Yeah, well, we're not really wired yeah. for complete silence. Yeah. Because we're animals. Number two for me. Number two, Ian. Another solid under $10 item is, drum roll please, Melinda's Pizza Hot Sauce. It's friggin' wow. great. It's so good. It's like, it's like, Can it's a crush. you put on other things besides pizza? Yeah, but it's, I have, but it might be kind of weird. Taste it. it. It's like pizza sauce, but spicy. It's got like fresh red pepper and stuff in it. It's not super spicy. Mm, it's, it's really good, good right? It's sweet, too. Yeah, kind of. Sweet with a little kick. Yeah, it's definitely got like a bunch of tomato and That's stuff good. in it. It's really good. How'd you discover that? I got it at Bucky's. I got like this and some ghost pepper wing, some ghost pepper wing sauce that is like insanely hot like it's, it's delicious super That's hot good. but this I is like really that. good it's like it's kind of mild it could be a little spicier but yeah it's a two out of five star it's a two out of five it probably should be a three but yeah. it's delicious it's good on pizza nice. if you like your pizza to have a little extra especially if it's domino's to so kick Darn. it up a notch because domino's is pretty funny okay <clears throat> all right item number three what do you buy the guy who has everything who Come has on. all the amazon products <laughs> All right, so it's a beer charger. This is a beer charger. It charges all your beers with electrolytes, <laughs> so you're better hydrated. Adds protein to your to your uh, drink. No, this is uh, I stir it with the a little. Uh, well, it's a charging station, obviously, but it just prevents from having all the cords. So you got Apple Watch if you got one of those. Okay. Wireless charger here for the AirPods. Huh. Wireless charger for I the AirPods. How does an AirPod charge? Can you the, do you have the thing? The uh, here real life demonstration with it not plugged in. I've never had AirPods. Uh, you just set it on there. That's it. it. So charges. it charges just like that. Yes, charges like that. That's crazy. Same thing with the cell phone. The cell phone, you know, you just set it here. Charges. Is this USB C? Oh, no, it's lightning. So you can you can charge it that way, but both of these things are wireless now. So that's cool. So and you how get does rid of all your all your cords. There? Do you have to like strap it in, or is it just no, a magnet? No, it's, it's actually magnetic, and you would. So I got this. Remember when people used to say station. like magnets and batteries are bad? Like, yeah, you know. Excuse me. Cut that. Cut uh, that, please. <clears throat> this is really cool. Yeah. So hey, you got no cords hanging all over the place. You put everything in one spot. Bing, bang, boom. So of, of the three items that that charges, I only own one. So. They have charging stations for every combination, like this, for combinations of whether you're Apple or not. So, so if you're Apple or you're like one of those weird people. One of those people that doesn't have an iPhone. One of those green people. Those green text <laughs> messages that you get, you're like, <clears throat> All right, that's my item number three. So um, this item right here is a jumper box for your car. So you take this little guy right here and this little guy right here. And this is enough. You hook it on your this batteries. Is enough power to jump it. It can jump it multiple times. Wow! So you click it on the battery. It's the impressive. Light, the light turns green. You hit. The, well, you plug it into here. Watch that. I'm gonna do a full display Sorry, here. I'm stealing it from. So me. you be the battery. So I'm clicking it on right. you. Yeah. I'm, here's my positive. No, no that's gonna hurt. <laughs> I okay. guess it does. Yeah. <laughs> so you These plug strong it in. Strong clips. I yeah. can test and then the, it's like, all right, the you're gonna go. Ah. And so you don't need anybody's help. So That's cool. you can jump start it. And it even has a flashlight on there. It has a flashlight. It has a USB C oh, yeah. out. So it has charge uh, your phone. two different um, USB uh, yeah. USB outs. How do I do the flashlight? There you go. Flashlight. Look at that. Um, Powerful. It's got a strobe. If you're, if you're it's got trouble. SOS. In case uh, you're really in trouble and somebody knows Morse code. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone knows Morse code. It's got a compass. This one does. Most of them don't have a compass, but most of them have a flashlight. That's cool. And phone chargers. It's also impressive that the little thing can. And be it's. Enough the, I mean, juice. I haven't charged it in months. Like and it's full battery. Like, and it's still full battery. It just sits in the trunk so of my car. So how much do you think that was? Sixty. It was like 50, 60 bucks. When that's I first pretty, started buying I feel them, like they were that's like pretty good. They were like thirty dollars, and yeah. I would give them away to people. Like I, 
I gave one to my brother-in-law because like his battery died, and I was like, here, man, use this, and you can just keep it. That's a good idea. I actually and like then, that a lot. I'm gonna buy things from I'm like this. I've liked yeah. this one and this and one. And then you, you can charge it. Yeah. USB C in and out on the thing, wow. and it's got a little wall plug, and it's got a charger for your phone. That's you can cool. even charge your laptop, so you can write offers on the go in case your laptop's dead out there. Like, I have had that, and I have a little one like this big, but it would not jump start my car. So that's cool. I like that. Yeah. Jump start your car, charge your phone, whatever you need. Item number four. <clears throat> can you guess? Is it some sort of massager? <laughs> this is a neck massager. Okay. And um, ready? This is also like. If you ever get like no, this one, like when you get headaches and stuff too, like this okay. is pretty good. But you do a little like this, and it's got these balls on it. It's just you know, this David? was like this was like ten dollars. <laughs> David, you can add this to your screenshots. <laughs> Give it a whirl. All right. Give it a whirl. They look like golf balls. It's funny. Yeah. They're squishy. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Okay. So, because that spots, you know. Yeah. So it's. So, you either need a wife or one of these. It's, you get you know, in there deep. If your wife doesn't have strong hands, or if too, you get you, it right on the you name, got, you can make yourself pass out. <laughs> you can do that too. It can be a dangerous tool. Yeah, I don't know. It's not so bad. I'll tell you what. I'll buy one of these. You buy one of those, I'll buy one of these. Look, my, the strobe light's just like. <laughs> it's a cool thing. It's a good time. toy. Yeah. My next item cooler yeah. backpack. You can't beat a cooler backpack. Oh. It is plastic lined so you can wash it out. It doesn't like leak through. Like some of them are sewn at the bottom. It is, what brand is this? What do you call this? Uh, Torrit. Torrit. Explore the it's world. It's got a bottle opener. I was at my sister-in-law's house the other day. At her house, brought, you know, some drinks in this. Shouldn't have a bottle opener in the whole house. So right here on the strap, it's got two dry storage compartments. That is pretty nifty. It's got, sorry, it's got three. Oh, Dry yeah. storage compartments. We have some so kids various your, kid items. You can put your school books in there. There's even some money in this one. Wow, that was at least five dollars. It was like two dollars, but in yeah. case of emergency, it's got uh, you know dry storage, a little water bottle Very holder. Nice. How much does that run? I think it was twenty eight dollars. I think I looked at them all last night, but it was kind of nice. Forgot. I think it was 28 bucks. I like that. It keeps stuff really cold, and it's good. Like So we bought it. It's perfect for your, I mean, going to the beach, you know? Perfect for the beach. Perfect for kids, because you want to bring them snacks and yeah. juice and the park. Bam. Right in here. Boom. It's, you can flatten it out and stick it in a closet. I don't know. Uh, it's pretty comfy. It was good for when we went to the race in Daytona. You can bring a cooler. Nice. Bring our stuff. I'm not going to put it on the table, because it's huge. Boom. And you can bring all your show and tell items. Yes, and you can put it in your backpack. In your backpack. For your next Tears Over Beers episode. No problem. Boom. All right, <clears throat> my fifth item. This is a salt lamp. This is for the vibes, right? <laughs> this is for, this is this is great. This is great lighting. Let's get some and vibes. It's also going. yeah. Let's get some vibes going. Hold on. I love like fun lights, you know? Yeah, it's just like, and it's also like, it's got, you know, however <sighs> light. Oh, it's dimmable. Light, yes. My mom oh, has one of these. See how heavy that thing is. Oh my God, it's way heavier than I expected. Yeah, like that's, it didn't come off the table at first. That's like a real salt is lamp. Is it real salt? Have you licked it? It's a, I haven't licked it. Do you want to try that? I don't want to lick it, but it's your it's lamp. Actually, so. yeah. I don't know if that's from being in the box, but it gives a little warmth. It's probably too. from the light bulb. <laughs> But it's the warmth helps expel the vibes into the room. I'm pretty sure, um, and I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I got two of these for like twenty five dollars. That's a deal. Like they were actually like, I was like, wow, these things are cheap. Also, double use, worst case scenario, home intruder, bomb over the head, over with, that the head thing. with it. I mean, that thing, it's just, it's a solid ten, that might be 10 15 pounds. pounds. Yeah, yeah. Like that's that's legit. She's got some weight to her. She's got some for weight. Sure, that's a Hardy Boy right there. Yes. Salt lamp, number five. <clears throat> Salt lamp, number five. All right. My next and vital item is the uh, next step to toilet seat with built-in child seat. I did not bring it in because it's a toilet seat. But if you look here, and we'll show the audience this fine item. It's got a kid's seat that magnets to the lid. So it's got like a regular seat and a kid's seat. So they can put it on themselves, ah. do their biz, and then... Can you do the bidet 
seat yeah. with it. Absolutely. So, so they're compatible. Sixth item, they're the compatible. bidet. And Your surprise item is the bidet. My surprise item is the bidet. If you don't have one, <laughs> put that up on the screen. You don't know what you're doing with your life. <laughs> but uh, there it is. If anybody else wants to take a look, you know, Ayana's going to put it on the video. You don't here. want to take that off of your toilet seat to bring it in? No, I didn't. What if one of the kids has to go? That's true. Number two while I'm here. That's, I like it. Yeah. The I most like annoying it. part about like potty training and small children using the toilet is having to have a stupid toilet seat thing on. Um, they have to put if you on, have to use you have the, to put on. the toilet, then you've got to take it off. And then when they need to use it, they got to put it on. It's a whole uh, mess. So this just, boop, boop, it's right there. Parents it's, around the world take note. Yeah. If you have kids and you don't have one of these, you are absolutely missing the whole point. So. Anyways, thanks for watching another incredible episode of Tears Over Beer. Incredible Beers. episode. Number 13. Over. We'll see you on episode 14. Cheers, buddy. Cheers. Now go!